Repikov as the band. Fly right chicken has been an Austin specialty since 2016. We are a staple uh, of Austin being on the east side. Director of operations Dallas Miller says the goal was to make drive through food a craft experience. There's nothing better than seeing the regulars, you know, our loyal guests, combine with this new faces coming through excited about the brand. Now they have two locations and also sell at the airport a prime position for fall festival season in Austin. Between the Austin City Limits Music Festival and Formula One alone, about 900,000 visitors are expected in the city this month. I know everybody loves to make a, make a joke about it and be like, oh, Austin's about to get overwhelmed with people for the next three weeks, but honestly, like, there's nothing better for this city. Travis Krogman with the Austin Chamber of Commerce says there's no underplaying the impact these events have on Austin. It's huge for small businesses. You're probably gonna go to a restaurant. You're probably going to stay at a hotel. Uh, if you're an event uh, producer, you're going to use catering services. For context, Fly Right Chicken's 7th Street location averages 500 sandwiches a day, or 3,500 a week. They had a stand at ACL where they sold 10,000 sandwiches across the two weekends alone. So, like, it's, yeah, it's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Data from the Texas Comptroller's Office shows Austin received nearly $28 million in tax revenue from sales it did last October. That number is only dwarfed by the holidays and back to school. The more impressive numbers, though, come from alcohol taxes. With nearly $1.9 million in revenue coming in last October, compared to an average of $1.46 million earned during each other month of the year. More jobs created, more wages, more payroll on the books. That's really, really important to make sure that our city budget is, is healthy. But while Miller says all this talk of money is nice, it's really the culture of Austin that's the most attractive during this time of year. Yeah, man, this is why I love doing this, right? Like, it's I love just serving people great food. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.